So now we're going to be talking about bad concentration. And if you're one of those players that plays really good pool when you're practicing or with your friends, but when you're in a tournament or you're playing somebody who's better than you, you tend to freeze up when you're on the table and then you end up missing shots you normally wouldn't miss. Or you get down on a shot and you really haven't thought it out too well and you're looking around and, well, there's a three ball, I need to be over there, so now I need to adjust my aim, I need to fix my English. And you start noticing people walking around in the background. And before you know it, you've lost all your concentration and you end up missing the shot. Or you get down on a shot, but you're so nervous, you just completely forget about position. You just say, just make the shot so I don't look stupid. So then you make the shot, but then you end up with no position on your next ball. Well, I'm going to show you some steps you can do that will almost eliminate all of that. And here's what you have to do. If you have poor concentration, what I want you to do is when you're standing up in front of the shot, I want you to find your aiming line for the object ball. And then find the area on the table where you want the cue ball to end up. Next, I want you to feel the speed of the shot in your arm. I want you to feel that speed. Next, place your stick on the aiming line. I want you to drop straight down, keeping that stick on that line. And then when you do get down on the table, just take two, maybe three practice strokes and fire away. You don't want to spend a lot of time on the pool table. You want to do all your thinking while you're standing up. Because when you're standing up, there's no pressure on you. You can take your time. You can look around, you can map it out, you can plan it out. And then once you have everything planned out, once you have everything lined up, ready to go, I want you to get down there, a couple strokes, and fire that ball in the hole. So if you can just plan out what you're going to do while you're standing up, feel the speed of the shot, see that aiming line, get down, two or three practice strokes, and then fire away. And the truth is, playing nine ball or eight ball, most shots are pretty simple. But what players tend to do is they tend to overthink everything. They get down on a shot and they start thinking about their mechanics. They start thinking about their speed, their aim, their position. They start thinking about too many things while they're down on the table. And before you know it, you lose all feel for the shot that you're about to perform. So if you can just plan ahead, figure out everything you want to do, figure out how you want to pocket the ball, what kind of English, where you want the cue ball to end up, and then get down on the table. Make sure everything is lined up. Make sure your tip is lined up with your aim in line. And if it is, fire away. And if something doesn't look right, if something doesn't feel right, stand back up, go through the process again, plan everything out, get down there, two, three practice strokes, fire away. This will definitely help you.